Lava Foundation College of Science and Technology, College of Education, Vision, Cotabato Foundation College of Science and Technology, Haven of Intellectuals in 2023, Mission, Cotabato Foundation College of Science and Technology shall endeavor to be a potent vehicle in uplifting the socio-economic status of its clientele and neighboring communities through the provision of custodial care services, access to education, and relevant training in science and technology. Core values, culture sensitive, adherent to laws, relevant and responsive, efficient and effective, and spiritually oriented. Course name, Gen Ed 115, Science, Technology, and Society. Course credit, three units. Course description, the course deals with interaction between science and technology and social, cultural, political, and economic contexts that shape and are shaped by them. This interdisciplinary course engages students to confront the realities brought about by the science and technology in society. Such realities pervade the personal, the public, the global aspects of our living and are integral to human development. Scientific knowledge and technological development happen in the context of society will all add its social, political, cultural, economic, and philosophical underpinnings at play. This course seeks to instill reflective knowledge in students that they are able to live the good life and display ethical decision-making in the face of scientific and technological advancement. This course includes mandatory topics on climate change and environmental awareness. Conduct hours per week, 3 hours a week or 54 hours. Prerequisites, none. Course requirement, 1. Research work and assignment. 2. On-time submission of written works, exercises, and reports. 3. Cheating during examination, copying, and plagiarism of submitted materials are never allowed. Fourth, the instructor reserves the right to either accept or deny outputs that are submitted later than the due date. Grading system. Following the quality policy manual of the College of Education, the grading system will be as follows. Quizzes, 30%. Class recitation, participation and attendance, 10%. Project and performance, 30%. Midterm and final term exam, 30%. For a total of 100%. Final rating shall be computed as follows. Final rating is equal to final term grade multiplied by 2 plus the midterm grade overall divided by 3. Course Study Guide This module was prepared for you to work on diligently and independently. Remember, this is meant for you to advance your knowledge to become confident in teaching the subject area, not only in your practicum, but also when you're already a full-fledged teacher. Doing activity is challenging, but with the help of your course facilitator, that's me, Ma'am Jam, and your enthusiasm, you'll be able to ace it. Here are a few reminders that we need to keep in mind. First, manage your time well. Schedule properly your reading assignments and your activity accomplishments. Have your planner or calendar of activities ready. Remember, you have other modules to accomplish for this semester. Second, focus your attention. Make sure that you do things one at a time. Read the material over and over until you're able to get the point of the lesson. If you do not understand the lesson, you can read the other materials found in other resources like the internet or books. Or you can ask for help of your parents, siblings, or friends. Do not forget, I am here to help and assist you. You can message me through platforms I'll be giving you. Third, give your best. In doing the assessment task, whether formative or summative, target the highest standards because you are a better student. 
you have the knowledge and skills that you need to finish with quality on your work. I believe in you. Fourth, submit on time. Before the end of midterms and finals, you'll be submitting the accomplishment activities in the modules through correspondence. Once I receive your materials, I will inform you immediately. Fifth, be patient. I will make sure to give my feedback on your work to ensure that you are on the right track. While waiting on my feedback, you can continue working on with the other activities. Make sure that you do not miss any important part of this module. Sixth, answer confidently. In answering the assessment and evaluation activities, you are expected to do the following. Write neatly and legibly, and write only on the module if you are sure of your answers. Make sure to give your answers completely and concisely. If questions need to be answered in essay form, stick to the point. Follow the specific number of words given in the instruction. Also, give proof on your claim or point of view. Cite correctly the references you use in your work. 7. Work independently. It is expected that you work on your module on your own. You can ask help from others but do your best to do it first. 8. Motivate yourself. Whatever knowledge or skill you're gaining from this course will definitely help you in your career. Enjoy what you're doing and everything else will follow. And ninth, contact me. If any part of the module or lesson you need my help and guidance, do not hesitate to contact me through email, messenger, or SMS. Remember, I am here to ensure that we go through the completion of this course together. I am Ma'am Jamela Sampulna.